How's it going, everybody? This has got to transform the wall. I have today the other three pack promo blister for Celestial Storm. This one features Tapu Lele. And first of all, really, really happy. This is an actual uh, Black Star promo, uh, not an alternate art one. Uh, this will actually go in my promo, like, like actually in a promo section. <laughs> uh, so I'm really happy with that. And it's, it's SM45. Uh, I guess they. This is something that was meant to be released a lot earlier than this, and they are only now getting to actually releasing it. Uh, so cool that they are actually filling in uh, some holes like this. I'm pretty sure the Tapu Bulu was another case of that, where it's like, I think that was like 61 or something. We're into the hundreds for the promos for Sun and Moon now. Uh, but just nice that they're filling in the holes and we don't have a case like the... Uh, black and white promos does where there's like a missing pikachu and raichu that were never released uh but yeah thankfully we don't have that and i've got something to fill a hole uh this obviously comes with three packs one guardians rising and two celestial storm kyogre coin and a promo and code card it's, i'm gonna hope there's something in here i i'm pretty sure just by having guardians rising though this opening is tainted. <laughs> like, I do not have any luck with Guardians Rising in the slightest. I've rarely had pulls that were full art or better. I have none of the secret rares. Like, none for this set. Uh, and, not, like, for example, I already have one for Celestial Storm. Uh, but, yeah, just... Guardians Rising has not been kind. Uh, in the background today, we have Sharktacon, Bulbasaur, and Luke Skywalker. That's right, that is a Star Wars Transformers crossover figure, and this particular Luke Skywalker turns into the Snowspeeder uh, from the second movie, at least, or the fifth, however you want to look at it. The uh, Which one is it? It's a, it's a New Hope, uh, Return of the Jedi, Empire Strikes Back, that's it, <laughs> from Empire Strikes Back. Uh, but here is the Kyogre coin. I'm not going to focus on that because trying to focus on this is going to be pretty impossible because it's so small. Uh, but that's pretty cool. Nice blue coin. There's a code card. I'm keeping that since this is an actual promo. And I want that for the online game. But there is the Tapu Lele promo. Very nice looking. Like I said, SM45. Very nice to fill in a hole in the binder. Uh, so we got three packs, Guardians Rising and two Celestial Storm. Go all this news and we'll just get Guardians Rising out of the way <laughs> right here. And I'll give you guys a code card for Guardians Rising. Pause and take that if you want. Hopefully you get something good from that. And we've got four and two. All right, so first pack is going to give us a Fletchling, the Twick. Gothita, Pancham, Alolan Vulpix, Gliscor, Komala, and Slowbro. Reverse, Komala, so uncommon right there. We had in that same pack. Uh, where's Guardians Rising? Here we go. Do I need Komala? No, I do not. So that one is a duplicate. That is okay, though. The rare. Pangoro, non holo rare. Pretty much what I have come to just believe is the case for Guardians Rising uh, and myself. Just nothing's going to come out of them. Uh, so, I mean, I've been surprised once or twice, but really I don't get any good pulls from them. But now we have Celestial Storm, and this is where I'm, fingers crossed, we'll hopefully get something really good. <laughs> Alrighty, so... We have a Slugma, Beldum, Larvitar, Whalmer, Bellsprout, Apricorn Maker, Dawn Fan. I know I'm, I'm missing some uncommon still. Uh, Dawn Fan isn't one of them. Okay. And Scyther. Scyther is not one either. Okay. <laughs> Reverse. Ooh. Kyogre, that is awesome. I believe that's a hollow normally. 
I def I'm definitely missing the normal version of this, whether it's a hollow or not. Uh, but that is really nice looking artwork. That might be my favorite artwork from this set. That looks amazing. Uh, the rare Swampert. So a couple water types there. Uh, Swampert is not one I need. But I'm very happy with that Kyogre. Now we come to the final pack though. Blaziken's on this. We need last pack magic to get, at least give us something. Uh, there's a code for you guys. Pause and take it if you want it. Hopefully get something good. All right, so final pack is going to say Torchic, Slackoth, Shuppet, Trico, Cacnea, Lantern, Switch, and Loudred, Reverse, is a Jirachi Prism. Awesome. That is actually my first Prism for this set. And we did at least pull something. Like, I'm sure you guys probably already know, like, the code card thing. Uh, the back kind of tells whether or not there's a hollow or not. So I honestly thought we were going to end with nothing once again, like with the uh, shiny Tapu Koko one. But at least this last pack came through with a Prism. So very, very happy with that. Uh, the rare. Claydol. That is actually... Yeah, that's a card I still needed. So very nice. That last pack definitely came through there. So overall, very pleased with this three-pack opening. Uh, no hollows. Uh, no hollow. No GXs or full Rs are better. But we got this Jirachi Prism, which I'm super happy with. On top of that, we at least got one new rare with the clay doll. And this really, really awesome artwork of Kyogre in reverse hollow. Ooh, I wonder how that looks with a hollow. I hope that's a hollow normally. I'd love to see that with a hollow effect. That'd probably go really well with the water. Uh, but that will do it for this opening, everyone. Thank you all so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more openings, of course. Have a great day.